What's going on my little pig? Look at your BFF Port Shop here. I'm coming at you with another update with the Port Shop. So leave it to me to post the March update with Port Shop on the last day of March, which is also Easter. So happy Easter to all those that observe and, and celebrate Easter. Um, and uh, hope you guys had a fantastic weekend. I hope you had a good month because this is the last day of the month of March. But I uh, wanted to get an update with Port Shop out there before the end of the month because I told y'all I was going to try to do one a month and uh, went two for two. So let's try to make it three for three. So I'm on my way to pick up my grandma for uh, Easter dinner. Yes, the ghost shirt is ironic. And uh, I have my two dogs with me. So y'all saw Chandler in the beginning and uh, Ami's right back there actually. So, and so I just wanted to talk about the month of March and, uh, what I'm looking forward to in the month of April and, and all the, that good stuff. Um, I had a lot of growth in the month of March. I think we had, uh, I think it was uh, 30 new piglets that came to the channel. So thank y'all so much to the new piglets. I hope that y'all are enjoying the content and I hope that you guys are going to stick around for a while. Um, whether it be the food reviews or the gameplay or the vlogs or whatever gotcha. I'm hoping that, uh, hoping that it's your cup of tea and I hope that you uh, stay put and uh, tell your friends and your relatives and your next door neighbor that you might have a crush on that nobody knows about. But regardless, um, so the growth was great. I'm hoping for more of a growth uh, in the month of April and just wholeheartedly, I just wanted to say how much I appreciate y'all and, and thank y'all so much for all of the new subscribers. Um, and on top of that, the consistency that I've had on this channel, uh, I hope that it is going to remain consistent because I've been doing a food review each and every Tuesday and each and every Thursday so far this year. Um, and I do have my Tuesday food reviews that are, sorry, a dog trying to roll down the window. Uh, the Tuesday food reviews are going pretty much, I have one in the queue up until like the second week of April. So or May, second week of May, damn. So I have a lot of those. Most of them are energy drinks. Some are, you know, little snacks here and there. And uh, I just uh, hope that y'all enjoy those as well as the Thursday reviews that uh, y'all can vote on. Uh, I think as of right now, I think it's been the 48 hours. Um, I think Little Caesars Crazy Puffs are the winner. So I will do Little Caesars for Thursday, first review of April. And I uh, am also doing the last day of the uh, Marvel versus DC Madness, March Madness. Uh, the championship is Superman versus Spider-Man. So if y'all haven't voted on that, go vote on that. And uh, we'll see who the winner is come tomorrow. And just hope for, hope for a good matchup and hope for a good uh, overall voting turnout and uh, hopefully it's close hopefully it's not a blowout um, but I have seen a lot of Superman fans as of late and a lot of Spider-Man fans coming out of the woodworks so I uh, wish y'all would have showed up for Batman <laughs> I'm still a little salty about that that y'all y'all uh, knocked Batman out in the first round lost to Constantine are you kidding me are you kidding me it was just like definitely the underdog story for Constantine until he got to Spider-Man, I believe, is who knocked him out. So um, if anybody's going to knock him out, I'm glad it was my second favorite superhero, uh, if not my first. And uh, so hope you all have enjoyed that for the entire month of March. I do have next year's already planned out. I'm not going to get the details away. I'm going to let it be a surprise. But uh, yeah, I definitely have that um, ready to go. I just have to... Uh, place the seeds to see uh who's one through 32 um so very happy about that very happy about that and on top of that with the channel um i'm gonna hopefully do pretty soon because starting next week is when the the bison the spring football for madden uh that is starting next Tuesday. So uh, in two days, you'll, you'll get a uh, Bison series premiere, which is the uh, fantasy draft that I went through for the, the team. And 
So watch that. Hope you guys enjoy that. And the Huskies will be, will be back in the fall. And uh, also, once I am finished recording the bison, I'm going to start working on Arkham Asylum. I've been watching a lot of Batman content as of late on YouTube, so I'm very, very in the mindset of the Dark Knight, in the mindset of, of the uh, Asylum game, because uh, Asylum is a really good game. And then once I'm through with that, I'll start recording, that was a big ass bump, uh, I'll start recording the uh, Silent Hill gameplay for Choptober, which Choptober is shaping up to be very interesting to say the least. Uh, because I am uh, almost through with my Nightmare on Elm Street retrospective script. I've been working on that very, very, very diligently throughout the past few weeks to get that done. Um, I kind of had a little skeleton of one last year, and so I'm kind of, you know, fine-tuning it and getting what I want in there. Um, the retrospective is not pretty... I, I, I say it in the video. I already, I already have it on the script. But uh, I'm not going to do like a rehash of Never Sleep Again, which is a four-hour Nightmare on Elm Street uh, documentary that goes through each and every film and uh, talks about it. And uh, I just talk about the movie. I talk about the plot and talk about my favorite kill and my, uh, the, the music and uh, just talk about some trivia and some you know, Easter eggs that, uh, I found interesting. So it's not just rehashing like copy and paste of, uh, never sleep again. I wanted to make it my own thing. Um, and I hope to do that with any retrospective that I make going forward because, uh, it's kind of lame to just, you know, change the word just a little bit and then call it my own, which I'm like, no, that's damn near plagiarism. That's not fair. That's not appropriate. So I just do what I do with mine and I uh, hope that y'all enjoy it. So that's going to be one part of Choptober. For those of you that don't know what Choptober is, um, in October, I am planning, fingers crossed, to release a video a day throughout the entire month of October. It's like my June vlog challenge. For those of you that don't know, the June vlog challenge is I post one vlog a day for the entire month of June. Um, and uh, so Choptober is kind of like uh, the challenge part two um, cause I think Choptober is definitely, um, October is one of those sweet spot months for me. I've always loved fall and I've loved Halloween and, um, football season and, you know, all that stuff. And Choptober, October has been always one of my favorite months. And so it's like a celebratory, um, challenge that I'm going to try to do and, uh, hope that y'all come along for that ride as well. So... That's enough of the channel, personal life stuff. Uh, there's really not much. I've just been working and pretty much going to work, go home like a, an American dad with Stan talking to his his daughter. Go to work, go home. Go to work, go home. Go to work, go home. That's pretty much what I've been doing. Um, going to work and then coming home and writing a script or recording a video or doing something that uh, is pretty much for the channel or just chilling. Uh, as of last night, uh, I started playing Minecraft again with my wife, and I made a, a pretty cool little uh, underground house with a fountain and a pool and everything on the outside, so uh, that was pretty fun to do. Uh, I've actually thought about doing Minecraft on this channel before, but I didn't know if there was uh, anybody that would be interested in that, so if you're interested in me doing a Minecraft, Minecraft series, uh, go ahead and shoot me a comment down below. Uh, I would definitely look into doing something like that because I've uh, had a lot of fun as of late playing Minecraft and seeing the Minecraft content especially on TikTok and you know all that cool stuff so anywho uh, so yeah wife and I just you know moved rooms uh, I talked about that I think on the last update where I talked to y'all about uh, the pig pen which is where I do my video editing and um, do my do my reviews on Tuesdays and all that good stuff. I definitely want to give y'all a, uh, a grand tour of it. Um, I did clean out a little bit more today. So, uh, it's getting there, getting there closer and closer every day. So hoping that, uh, it'll be ready for y'all soon to, uh, take a gander at, but, uh, yeah, that's pretty much the extent of the personal stuff. Um, 
anytime y'all want to talk about something, anytime y'all want me to re review something or something that piques your interest, just go ahead and shoot me a comment down below in any video. It could be this one. It could be a, a gameplay video. It could be a vlog. Just whatever. Uh, I'm down for it. And uh, so do that. And uh, I greatly appreciate it. But uh, all right, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you all so much once again for dropping by. I greatly appreciate y'all. And always remember my little piglets, Colin Porkchop. Loves y'all the most. So y'all take it easy, guys. And I will see y'all next time. Sorry, my dog just hit his head on the door. You okay? Bye, guys.